here we are we're gonna set up a logo so we go to the top view and we bring in let's close this so we know it comes from here and here and we're going to use that first one place we go find just look at the thumbnails here and it's the BMP here we go we can see it here so we know it's supported open and we'll place it right here there now we don't need the grid so F7 will take the grid out of the way I'm also going to switch to the red layer so that it's easier for me to see the lines that I draw and I'm going to draw a straight line no no snapping well, it looks like this is all one well, actually looks straight till about here so maybe right around there maybe a little bit or there something like that and I am going to now create an conic that is starts tangent to this one goes to the middle and maybe right here and right down the middle of that line there I'm going to join And I'm going to mirror from transform point. And I'm going to mirror from transform mirror and connect the top with a straight segment. Join And since this has a specific thickness right here, maybe we'll go ahead and go to our offset curve and use, it's set to 0.25. It seems a, bit, a little bit bigger than 0.25. Let's go with point, 0.4. Looks about right. And we'll use both sides. So there, and we can delete that one and there we have the shape of the outside border now we come over here and we have to trace a little dragon and for that we're going to use the interpolate points curve and I'm going to start maybe right here and go around the, the belly Here we go, looks like we got a Then we have another wing over here We have the tail, which I'm going to start inside. Select these and trim.
Uh, this can be fixed a little bit so we can show the control points with this tool and maybe no snapping and we can form there and maybe maybe give him a little eye and then JC correct so we go to text and they look like plain letters so we'll type J give ourselves some spaces and then put C Pick the right, maybe Arial Black, JC, Curves, and uh, we click OK. We place the J right here, get the C, move it over, hello, hello. We move on the C over to that side, and now let's turn off turn off the picture and this is our little logo and uh, there we go and basically this logo now is ready to be saved and be used for multiple uh, designs where for rings or different kinds of uh, uses.